Hello Chief Dave here, just coming out of the condo now, right, so firstly we'll do a little Ming Ming watch, which I don't see the cats anywhere, now apparently somebody's had two of the kittens away already, uh, no sign of them here at the moment, in the drains, nothing. So yeah, so no cats at the moment, but I've heard that two of the cats have gone now, so uh, been rehomed. So we're just waiting on the other two kittens to go, but we'll see if they're here when I come back home later. Right, today's video. It's about two o'clock in the afternoon. I'm going to be doing a little bit run around in the bat buses see where they go how you use them and uh, I'll do a little explanation just here so you come out of my apartment uh, condo block onto Papaya you go up the hill that way you're heading for Patea going down the hill that way you're heading for uh, John TM. So we're right by the bus station here as you can see. Uh, you've got the food mat just over there. So give you some idea, traffic lights just down the road. You've got uh, Threpsey Road where I've done the map. You've got to go. Looking from here. So as you can see, you've got the motorbike taxis here, you've got the normal taxis flying about. Uh, if you wait this side of the road just for a minute or so you get the bar buses come down and that'll take you into John TM so that looks like a bar bus but it's probably a fruit seller by the look of it second one same thing for the third one quick 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 quick, quick. <laughs> And the third one is so yeah basically you can wait for a bar bus coming down there and that'll take you into John TM now oh yeah so this way when these uh, traffic lights change will be a bar bus after the mo oh so we see a bar bus down there the traffic lights so we're waiting for the lights to change Try and get across. So after this man with the trailer. That bus coming. So we're alright. Here he comes, he's indicating to pull over. And we're getting the bar bus to Patea. So here we go. So that's easy. So we're on the bar bus heading for Patea. So what I'll do now, I'll show you any places of interest on the way and all of this lot for 10 baht. Okay, so the manager just told me it's two o'clock. So for the moment, we're still heading up for Patea. Only been traveling about a minute and we've got to get to Central Road in Patea. Okay, so we stopped at the traffic lights at the top of uh, the hill of Propraya. That road over there takes you into Brasimac. And we're on our way down the hill. And we'll be almost going into Patea soon. Okay, so we're just at the bottom of the hill of Propraya. Going round the corner, left hand turn. And we're right by his overpass here. So this is what I think splits the chair from John T. M. So come up to the traffic lights anytime now. Take it right there and now we're on road two in in Patea. Okay so we've come to the right hand turn and 
this is road two in Batea. So we're just coming to the south side of Batea now. There's the overpass. Give you some idea where we are. There's some massages down here. And just down here somewhere is a 7-Eleven, which I've, I uh, did a drink in my days at 7-Eleven. This one. Okay, so we're now down to Soi is it? South Protea Road which is just over there now dead opposite you've got the taxis queuing up by the orange and blue uh, wall the school wall and that's the taxi or the bar bus you take back to John T. M. Uh, yeah, to John T. M. So there we are you go down this road here where we go but usually they go straight up Maybe he'd go down. <laughs> okay. Okay. So we're down as far as the day of Thai. That takes you to Walking Street down there. But the bar bus turn right for some reason. Now they don't usually do that, you usually go straight on. So we have to get a second bar bus just down here. So we're still on road two and we have to get a second bar bus. Second bar bus, just gone past Patea Toy. <laughs> Usually, I only spend 10 baht to go to Central Patea Road, but today I've had to spend 20 baht. But it's not a lot of money. Yeah, so on second road. Heading for Central Patea Road, which is not far, probably about another two or three minutes we'll be there, maybe five. But you've got that edge, the big building you can see down there, that's a large condo block. If you go up there, you've got Soy Diana and LK Metro, and you end up on. Uh, so the cow. So anyway, you can get on the barbers anywhere down here, off the barbers. So we're going to get off at Central Patea Road. Now, if you stay on the barbers, it'll take you to North Patea Road, up by Terminal 21. So that'll be the whole of the journey along this direction on the barbers. If you want to come back, you have two choices. You can either come all the way along Beach Road from the very end, get off a walking street, walk up to the school wall that I showed you, jump on another bar bus there, take your Pratumac and John Tier. So very simple that way. If you're going up towards Soy Bacow, that'll bring you all the way back along to Patea Toy or South Patea Road. And you'll just walk down to the school wall again, jump on the bar bus, same thing again, Pratt and Mac and uh, John TM. Easy as that. But I'm going to be showing you the Soy Bacay route on the way back. So there's the edge, 
up there and the road that runs by the, by the base of the edge is Soy Diana and you walk up there come Soy Bacow so all very easy and there is Soy, Soy Diana so the next one we'll be coming to is Central Potato Road. So you've got the myth night market over there. There's a load of uh, small open bars. And we're coming down now, soon, to Soy 7, and then Central Potato Road. See the blue sign up there? You got Patea Memorial Hospital, and just down the road from here, Manda. We we'll get off here. Okay. So we're going to walk down to the traffic lights down there. No, I don't think so. But thank you. <laughs> okay. So that's the bad bus paid for. We're going to walk to traffic lights. But that's where you want to get off there, traffic lights. Yeah. So, we walk up to road, uh, Central Potato Road. Okay, so the bar bus will bring you down here to these traffic lights, but then it'll go straight on. And you can go all the way down to the end uh, on road two, down to Terminal 21. Now if you get on the bar bus just round the corner from there towards the beach that'll take you all the way back up to Walking Street where you get the second bus back into Pratt and Mac and John TM. So here we are on Central Potato Road. Up here you go so far you come to Road 3 and then you come to where Amanda works by the Big C Extra. So I'm going to say goodbye to Amanda in a minute and she's going to carry on walking up to work. Okay so what I've done, I've got off the bar bus and then set the traffic lights just down there. I've walked up Central Road to opposite the Beach Bar Pharmacy, the 7-Eleven and the HM Hammond Clinic and the road you've got here is Soy 13 Kasem Sivan, Kasem Sivan. Basically that's the end of Soy Bacow so you get on a bar bus here it's going to take you all the way along into in, into the cent centre of Patea, LK Metro and all that lot. Uh, go through that lot, come to South Patea Road and you'll end up taking a right there and just past the temple you need dropping off to get your second bar bus home. And it's that simple. So if you carry it on straight and then traffic lights and went to North Patea, you can go down towards the beach, get a bar bus anywhere along there and that'll take you all the way back to Walking Street and uh, Soy Song and you get your same minibus back to uh, John TM and Platinum Mac from there. So I think it's fairly simple really but I'll show you the bar bus journey back you let me know what you think. So I'll cross the road here, see how, what time is it now, and then uh, see how long it takes for me to get to South Korea. Okay, so it's three, it's 2.40, sorry. On the end of what I call Soy Bacow, but it's the road I just give you. Soy 13. 
hopefully the minibus will turn up any time now to take us. Here it comes now, look. So we're going to get on this that bus here, and that'll take us all the way along to the cow, back to the temple. So waiting time at the end of sort of cow was less than a minute. And I can see that four cars behind us, another bad bus pulling into Toy the Cow. So regular as clockwork. You haven't got to wait hardly any time. This end of Soy the Cow, a lot of massage. Uh, well, which is a few bars, a few restaurants, a few accommodations, but it's that easy. I'll just come back on a little few places of interest. at the end of the sort of cow and I can be getting off anywhere I like along here and the charge will be the same ten part. That's where I did my budget video from the other day. Friendship bar. through the little stick cave now so you've got the easy corner there and you've got the witherspoons just here the yellow and blue building so bars and bars and bars all the way along here area just down there always a 7-eleven this is the time of day when all the bar girls are rolling up for work the vast majority of them are having their lunch or breakfast or whatever it is The one bar over there, this stop. So this is the back end of Tree Day. Down there, a few big restaurants sitting around here. There is the main entrance to Tree Town and all the little street foods. That's your main entrance, the real road there. It's 
shrine over there to Buddha. A few people paying their respects. Got soy honey there. And the honey bar on the corner. That is LK Metro. Well, a go go bars and other bars down there. That's where sugar sugar is. So yeah, you can jump on or jump off the bar buses any time you like. So even if you want to go to Pratt and from here, just jump on this bus. Takes you to the temple. Looks like she's got her pyjamas on. This road here is Soy Diana. Loads of bars, open bars down there. And that place on the corner, we had great spaghetti at night. One of the places I used to go to. And I had a few beers. So that's Soy Diana. And there is Soy Bottle, just by that top daily. Next road on our uh, on our right will be Soy Lenke. Sometime soon. That cheap chal is up there. girls when I did a load of videos inside they let me video and we go back and look at them that's got to be getting on a year ago now bars over there. Going through the madness part of uh, sort of the cow. Go through a little chicane here.
buses coming and going. So we're on the chicane now where the markets are. the new market this side of us where you sell all the new stuff and then on the left hand side we've got the second hand market a few red stalls but all these clothes there 70 bar 150 bar depending on what you're buying but all second hand stuff you can see it's mainly Got motorbikes on the road. Use this clutch there. Yeah, so that's your second hand market. And we're down to Soy Song. Sorry, Soy Song. We're down to Patea Tai, which is Central Patea Road. See the sign over there. So we're at the end of Soy Bacao now. We'll be taking a right down that way. That was just going to be from down there, and just after you pass the temple down here, you have to jump off and get a second bar bus back towards Bretonwood and John TM. So, yeah, easy as that. That bus is very easy. We're on Patea Toy at the moment, which is South Patea Road, I think that to uh, translate to. And I will wait till I get as near to the traffic lights as I can. Then I've got less walking to do. Oh, someone's getting off. Uh, to go on this bad bus now. This is always a busy little area, lots of shops. We've got the Toucan there, which is a big electrical place, there's computers, telephones, it works. Well, we've just hit the start of the Temple Wall. So, anywhere here to the traffic lights, and you've got a very short walk to the next bar bus. So, I hope this uh, is helping you with your getting to know how to use the bar buses. I'm spending my money like that just to help people out. Right? There's all the temples over there, all the temple, the different buildings. So anywhere down here, oh, I need to, I need to get off here. Okay, so let's see where he dropped us off. So let's see where he dropped us off. We've come all the way along uh, Soy Bacow, come down here past the school wall, past the temple over there, to these traffic lights. Yeah. So we're right by the school wall. This is where the first bar bus dropped us off. They took a ride here. They weren't taking us all the way down. 
potato, uh, central potato root, get it right down second road. Sometimes I've been on a bus from coming that way from Brattleneck to TM, and it's taken me all the way down road two, right to the far end by Terminal 21. So you can get all the way to 10 bar sometimes, it just depends on if they turn off somewhere. Now this one decided to turn off down here, down Patea Tide. I think she was planning to do a U-turn, come back down here, head back up towards Patea uh, Tide. Um, right to back. So anyway, we're back here. We'll have a little uh, look around the corner. There should be a queue of bar buses that head for Pratumnak and John Tia. So we'll see if they're here. You know me, I'm never right. There we go. Big queue of bar buses. One, two, three, four, five, six. I can see seven. Probably more than that. So we'll go and grab a bar bus and head for Pratumnak and John TM. Right, so we're having the change of bar bus. These tend to fill up fairly quickly. So there's not too much waiting time. But we'll check it out, do it in real time. See how long it takes us to get on the move to John TM. Yep. He even told me where we were going, John TM. So, I'm first on the bar bus, but it'll soon fill up. So there's a pigeon. Having his dinner. Having some rice. The birds get well looked after around here. Yeah, so if you take a if you take a right and then drop a right, you're heading up towards uh towards the gate, take a left on the traffic right, and come to the end of Water Street. So this is where you get the bus for John Tien or Santa Fe. Very simple. This will take you right to the end of the beach on King John Tien. All for 10 bar. So, how easy is that? So this is the total reverse journey of what we've just taken. Coming into the tail. This will take us all the way down to Praia, all the way down to Beach Road in John TM, and then down to Burger King where me and Jay for a beer. Turned off road two. Just up here we're going to the traffic lights. 
coming out of what I'm interested in potato. This is Little India right there. Over here, got some mud. Tight massage there. Okay, there's all going up there. See from my cut low. But we're just at the top of the hill. Brea and if you go to that right, you're headed for Brea, Brea, right away. these traffic lights here and down there if you're heading for Matterback Okay, so we're just coming down the hill in Brea down towards my front road so you watch my videos you should be able to spot some of the places we're going past now. This is where I live. Just down here we'll have Fraser's Bar. I'm just past Fraser's Bar. We'll have the entrance to View Tele 1. Phases. If I want to go and watch the football, Premiership or the England games, but not on a stupid time at night, then I only have to walk up the edge of Phases. Where this red motorcycle is here, that's the entrance to View LA1. So if I was going home, I would get up here by the bus station and be on my way home. Okay, so that's the bus station where you get from here to, to the Suvan Brewery Airport, Bangkok. There's your food out there, they do a lot of European and American food in there. Motorbike rental. And that is for prayer. Uh, sorry, Leprosy Road down there. So all quite simple. Carry on down the hill to where we live. Okay, so we'll carry on down the there. Just to find quite a lot of accommodation along here. As well as bars and restaurants. Stuff like that, there's Don't Tell Mamas. Little massage place. We're nearly home. Hey, nearly home. Nearly down to meet Jay. Two. There's 
the entrance just there. So all from the school wall, all the way down here, get across the tent back. Okay, so if you continue down this road any further, it becomes road two instead of the prayer. So you go down, you go down there, and you come to the prayer. But well, you go to road two, but if you come down here, it's a continuation of the prayer. So when you get down to the end, up here, you're on Beach Road. All of this still for 10 baht. Country club. Only they put live music on in there. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> so we've got the Viper Bar there, like the go go. Crazy foreigner doing the winning. He's going to beat, he's going to beat, beat the uh, bus. So it looks very thick. Right, so we're at the corner of Beach Road and the player. Yeah, so we've gone down onto Beach Road now. And we're going to be heading along here. I'm going to be getting off at the Burger King. But that bus will carry on after that and it goes all the way down to the far end of the beach usually. Sometimes it turns off at the road where you've got the golden monkey. So you have to make it clear when you get on the bar bus whether you want to go straight on or whether you want to go back up where the gold monkey is. So we're back on the road works now. So we four starts now. It finishes down by soy five, uh, soy seven, sorry. So the road works finishes soy seven. Um, I wanna just be a little way past there. So that's what's going on in the road works. So you can see that. That's the Burger King. Uh, let's see exactly where we are. You've got the market down there, little kids' playground over there. 7 Eleven here. I'm going to be popping in this little shop here, grab a beer, 
can chill out over the road where I'll meet up with Jay somewhere over there. Okay, so we'll just summarise my little battle bus journey and how much it cost me. So, started off on Thrapraya, heading up towards Patea, past Pratomek, onto Road 2, when you go in the underpass into Patea, uh, all the way along Road 2 to Central Patea. Now, when he got to South Patea Road, he turned right for some reason, usually they go straight on. So that cost me 10 minutes to South Patea Road. Uh, from South Patea Road, along Road 2, to Central Patea, just past Central Festival. Uh, cost me another 10 baht. I walked up to uh, Soy 13, which when you go along there it becomes Soy Bacow. So from the end of there on Central Patea to the temple, and Patea Toy, South Patea Road, that cost me 10 baht. After that, I changed baht bus, uh, just round the corner on, on Second Road, and I ended up here on Beach Road in John TM. Now, I could have carried on to the end of Beach Road, but I'm meeting Jay here for a beer. So, I got off at the Burger King just over the road. From here, I'm going to be heading home after I've had a couple of beers down here on the beach. Uh, I'm going to meet up with Jay when he rolls up. So, what I'll do, I'll have to walk up to road two for getting my bad bus home jump on there, back up, for a, up road two to for a prayer, up the hill, and get off at Utah A1, and that'll be my total total journey. So in the end, uh, I'll have done 50 baht in money. I've been all the way into Patea, all the way back, here into John TM, and then back home. And it's cost me 50 baht, which is, I think it's about 45 to the pound, 44 to the pound at the moment, so just over a quid. And I've done all that uh, getting around. So, I hope it's not as clear as mud. I hope I've uh, helped somebody out on how to use the bar bus around here. Uh, it is very simple, but you've got to get used to it, really. Just get a little bit confident in it. Uh, I've been out here over a year and a half now, so get to know my way around now. So quite easy for me. For the newbie, maybe needs to go around a little bit on the bar buses just to see where where they can go, get to and whatever. Very simple. Uh, that's the end of the video. So please like, subscribe, press the bell. Uh, I'll be back with some more junk tomorrow. Uh, if you could subscribe to my new channel, Cheap Dave in Thailand 2, uh, Cheap Dave in Thailand 2, then I would appreciate that if you subscribe. Uh, and I'll be back with some more junk tomorrow. Just finished my beers on the beach. And I'm making my way home now by Barbus. So how do I get home from Beach Road back up to, where am I going? I'm heading, there he goes, there he goes! <laughs> so there goes Jay on his way home and I'm going to be heading home myself. Now I don't have the motorbike tonight. So, I'm coming up here, not sure what soy it is, but by the Nye Market, which is here, 
So this is how you get back towards Patea from John TM. Okay, so I'm here at the night market in John TM and I'm trying to get my bear bus home. So I'm going to head up to road two, which is up here, up towards the Riviera. You can see the sign up there. And that's where I'm going to be heading to get my bear bus home. So really this bad bus system is not a difficult thing to do. It's just on the in John TM you've got a one-way system now. So Beach Road, they go along to the far end of John TM. And you come up any of these side toys, you can get the bar bus home to Butel A1 or if you did want to get to Patea this is where you go to get the bus to Patea too so it's at the end of this road probably about 200 yards so we'll start the video again when we get there Okay, so we're getting to the other end of this soy now, up to road two, and this is a soy from the Night Market. You got on the left, you got the Riviera condos and hotels and whatever, and then this flashy building here. Not a clue, but it looks very nice. So I've just got to walk up this little hill here to road two and get the bar bus home. Okay, so now I've got to the end of this soy. I don't have a clue what it is, but the other end you've got uh, John Tim uh, Nine Market. So this is where we are. Coming out onto the main drag of road two. Hold on, let's go back a bit. So we've got road two here. And down here, you got an Italian restaurant there. You've got the Riviera, condos here. And then you've got this very colourful building with lots of light going on over here. So now, we're waiting here for a bar bus to take me home to Butel A1. So we'll see how long that takes us. So down this road here, road two, there should be quite a lot of uh, bar buses coming along. So we'll wait and see, see how long it takes. I'm sure it won't take long. I think I've seen one just pulling down the road, so hopefully we'll be able to get on that and make our way home. But it is so simple. If he does pull over, this one here now, it's going to cost 10 baht. Here we go. Hands pulled over and we're sorted. So they all eat that after you. So there we go. All sorted. On our bar bus back to John TM. It's going to cost me 10 baht to get home from that building and the Riviera here in John TM so probably going to be a two or three minute drive down here not too far roads are fairly quiet that's the Copacabana over there 
Riviera up there. So that's where we are. So we're doing you my bad bus journey home. Got saunas over there. 7-Eleven. Just here. And then we got Rompo Market. So we're here at Rompo Market, you've got all the beer bars going all the way, long way back. And then this end, you've got all the food. So if you want to come down for something to eat, you've got the Rompo Market there. And then over there, you've got the, the beer bars. You also have kiss food and drink, which is always a good place to eat. And we'll be pulling up to the traffic lights. By, excuse me, very bumpy. But this is this is road two. When we get past these traffic lights, just here, do some good pieces over there. Stop to the traffic lights now, just give a head up the road. This is where it changes from Propraia, uh, road two to Propraia. So if you look down this way, it carries on Propraia down to the beach road down there. So now we're on Propraia. And really, once you've done it a few times, these bad buses are very easy. So this journey, which I've videoed in total, was for 10 bar. So pretty good. So we have another 7-Eleven over there. Come to the traffic lights in a very short time. We come to Threbsim. Now the bus don't go down there, but if you want to go to Threbsim Market, you just get a bus 20 30 yards down that road and you can go down to the far end to the market. Now, someone's getting off at the bus station and I'm getting off too. So, hey. Excuse me. I only have popping cab. So I'll give him 20 baht. So I'll get here for 10 baht. And they've dropped me opposite the food mart. Some of the blow pressed the bell, otherwise I'd have pressed it a little bit later. But we've got a bus station here. This is where we started. So, all we got now is to walk up to Butel A1, there are the buildings over there, but your entrance is over here, and that is how you use a barber, very simple, very easy, very cheap. I'm going to cross the road now. And then go back to my apartment, view to A1. Obviously, I'm going to wait for this lot to come down here. And there we are, home and dry. That's how easy it is. So, if you could please like, subscribe, press the bell. I'd appreciate it. Uh, if you want to go onto my other channel, T David Thailand 2, then please subscribe to that too. 
I'll be back with some more junk tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Right, so one last thing before I finish this video. On the way out, I was looking for Ming Ming in the kitchens. Apparently two have been taken away and someone owns them now and they're looking after them well, I hope. But there are, or there were, two of the kittens and they should be down here somewhere. Now, I don't see. I did see a shadow at the end, but that car scared it away. But let's have a look anyway. Ah. And I think that is Ming Ming. So is she all alone now? She's been spayed. Or has she still got the two kittens, or has someone taken the two kittens away? I don't know. But, uh, yeah, so only Ming Ming visible tonight. That might be the end of Kitten Watch. <laughs>